guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be a full day of eating. I haven't done one of these for quite a while now. I know that you guys really, really enjoy watching them. I don't know why, I think they're not that interesting, but for some reason you guys love them. So I thought I'd do one because I haven't done one since I've started as cabin crew. So it'd be quite good to show you guys if my diet's changed or like how I'm eating now that I have a different job and I'm not a personal trainer and my lifestyle is totally different. I am still filming this on my iPhone. If you saw my last video, I haven't got my camera at the moment. I left it in Mauritius. And I am actually going to Mauritius tomorrow. So I'm gonna get my camera back tomorrow, which will be good. So I'm filming all of this on my iPhone, so it's not gonna be the best quality, but I will try my best. I have got a selfie stick, so I'm hoping that that will help. <laughs> also, I'm finding it really hard because I'm not really sure where to look, so I'm hoping that I'm looking in the right place, but it's really distracting with the screen right in front of me. <laughs> so today I have, so far, I have had two satsumas and some Melba toasts. Um, I've had a cup of tea with almond milk, and I had that this morning kind of pretty much first thing when I got up. Then I did a bit of like sorting out of my flat. I got ready, like put my makeup on, got dressed, and then I had some jelly, low calorie jelly, which I make myself. And then I had that with a mix of the Total Zero Farhe, I don't know how you say it, yogurt, with the low fat fromage fray, which has about the same macros in both of them. Um, I had 350 grams of that with some strawberries and blueberries. And then I also had some powdered peanut butter. If you guys haven't heard of that before, it's um, like lower fat than normal peanut butter. You just mix it with water. And I had some of that on top. And then I also had some frozen fruit, which I microwaved. And when you microwave it, it goes nice and like juicy and nice and sweet and poured that on top. And then I also had that with two Kalo rice cakes and two of the corn rice cakes. Um, just because I, I like the taste of both of them, so <laughs> I had two of each. I had that with another cup of tea. They're decaf um, cups of tea, by the way. Again, with the unsweetened almond milk and a little bit of sweetener as well. So that's all I've had so far. And I've just been sorting out my flat, doing a few like odd jobs. And I'm now also packing, ready for tomorrow. So I thought maybe I could show you kind of how I pack. I'm quite a messy packer. I just kind of like lay everything out and then pack it all last minute. Like when it's all, when I've put everything out, I then put it all in together. Also, because I take quite a lot of food, I tend to do it more last minute because of like freshness and stuff like that. Well, it depends if it's like dried or whatever. But I will be making a salad to take with me tomorrow, like a tuna salad to take on the plane because Mauritius is a 12 hour flight. So it's a long flight and I wanna try and eat as healthy as possible. Also just on reflection of my diet today, as you guys know, I don't really track anymore and I just kind of eat well and what I want. But I did eat quite badly this weekend. <laughs> um, I had a lot of food. It was a lot of calories consumed, so I'm just gonna make sure I work hard in the gym tonight. I worked quite hard in the gym last night. Try and get a session in before I go to Mauritius tomorrow as well. So yeah, I'm probably gonna do some packing now and then I'm gonna go to Sainsbury's. I need to get some more dry bits to pack for Mauritius and then go to the gym tonight as well. So I'll just quickly show you how it's looking at the moment, just to excuse the mess. If I take you through to the other room. Okay, so what I've done is I've got a big suitcase and then sort of like laid all my stuff out and, sorry, I'm just moving some stuff. And then I will pack it as I sort of go. Actually, it is really, really messy, but I'm gonna show you. Oh, I can't flip screen on this phone. That's really annoying, so I'm just gonna have to guess. But okay, so I've got um, like all my clothes laid out over here. I need to go through because I probably won't pack all of that. A small handbag to take. And then I normally put like my shoes in there, hat, hoodie, and some food I've started to get ready. So like rice cake, porridge. <laughs> Um, tea bags and coffee, bikinis, I think that's all my underwear, and then some more food over here. And then I normally put all my toiletries in like a double zip-up bag, but I take like minis and stuff, so mini shower gels, shampoos, and then I've got more in here as well. And my tripod for when I get my camera back. And then this is my big bag that I take on the plane with me. So I will have like my tuna salad in here as well. And I've got some beef jerky, my hot water bottle for my break, 
uh, my shoes and then I also take these little nut bags as well and in here I will put my Melba Toast Rivita and some dark chocolate and then in my handbag I keep a protein bar in there as well which is this one the fulfill one but yeah as you can see it's a bit of a mess right now but the aim is basically to go food shopping buy some more bits and then I'll probably put this all in together because I haven't really finished and I want to make sure I've got my rice cakes because they get really crushed so I want to wrap them up in clothes and then make my tuna salad as well ready for tomorrow and then it should be pretty much done because the only last minute things I need are hairbrush makeup toothbrush laptop and phone and phone chargers those are like the last five things I normally put in um, but yeah I normally just lay everything out and then put it all in rather than as long as I just forget what I've put in I'm gonna get on with doing a little bit more packing and then I'm gonna go to Sainsbury's I'll see you in the next clip I just got back from my food shop so I thought I would show you what I got and also what I'm going to be taking away with me. This selfie stick, I cannot wait to get my camera back. Um, I'm going to have to work out how to put you guys somewhere. But I got some more frozen fruit. Um, I got some more of these corn thins, which I'm going to be taking away with me. Some lettuce for tonight. And this, which I'm going to have now with... Actually, I'll tell you that, guys, as this is a, what I eat in a day. I'm going to have some of this, which is the Halo Top Sea Salt and Caramel ice cream and I'm going to have that with three of these just so you guys know I'm gonna have that in a minute when I've put this away I got some fruit some more of the fat free fromage fray which is the low fat one which as I said before has the same macros as total but it's literally like half the price these fin crisps which are really good and I'm gonna take those away with me so they're gonna go in my suitcase sweet corn which is gonna go in my suitcase some low fat Caesar dressing which is gonna go on my salad for the plane tomorrow. Also, I'm gonna be taking away these as well, which are tin peas. So I always take a can opener with me as well, because I take salmon, sardines, tuna, and then some tinned veg, just for like emergency lunches, and also for the plane journey home, because obviously it's really difficult to get healthy food out there. If I have that with me, it's just something easy to have for the way home. I did get some more beef jerky as well, which I'll be taking with me. Also, another pun of strawberries. So this is gonna be for my plane ride tomorrow. So I'm gonna put them in a Tupperware in one of these and then pack that for tomorrow. So that's everything that I got. So I'm gonna put that away. I'm gonna have the ice cream and rice cakes and then do some more packing. Oh, and also do my bids. So we have to do bidding every month for what flights we want. So I've got to do my bids for March because I'm going away tomorrow and the bid closes on Thursday. Yeah, and then I'm gonna have some porridge probably before I go to the gym because I'm gonna be going to the gym later. I will see you guys in a bit. I'm just making some porridge at the moment, but with my porridge, I've just put some of that Halo Top ice cream in a bowl because it was so good. With some frozen fruit. And then I've got some more frozen fruit ready to put on top of the porridge with some dark chocolate. And I'm gonna be putting in some protein powder. So this is the Protein Works Whey Protein and it's the birthday cake flavour. So I'm going to use that. But this is the protein powder, so I will put a discount code in the description box for you guys as well. Put that into the porridge. I have also put in some shredded courgettes. So I don't know if you guys have seen my other videos or you know the term zotes. So it's basically shredded zucchini. Zucchini is courgette, it's just the Americans call it zucchini. I'm going to put some of that into the porridge as well. It just kind of bulks it up so if you are dieting and you want to still feel like you're eating a lot of food it's quite a good thing to do. So I did it when I was cutting and I've just kind of got into the habit and it's a really good way of also getting veg in without really tasting it because obviously if you're putting the protein powder into the porridge and putting chocolate and frozen fruit on top then you don't really taste the courgette as much. I'll obviously show you when I've finished. Porridge, so we've got the birthday cake protein powder in there, 35 grams of oats, um, shredded zucchini or courgette, whatever you want to call it, frozen fruit and then dark chocolate on top which melts in when you stir it in which is really really good. So if you like sweet stuff this is really good. So I'm gonna eat that and then I've actually got to go back to my parents. So I'm gonna quickly go back there and then go to the gym and do some more packing tonight when I'm back. I will have dinner when I'm back tonight. Sorry, I'm holding my like 
charger for my phone because I'm running a really low battery and now I'm using my phone to film so it's quite annoying. But yeah, so I'm going to go to the gym quite late which means dinner will be quite late tonight but that's just the way it is. And then cook that and finish packing tonight. So I'm going to go and eat this and I will see you guys probably later on this evening when I'm back from the gym. If you guys are interested I'm basically going to do upper body and probably half an hour of spin. So quite a long session tonight but I obviously have got a trip away now so I kind of want to work hard and after the weekend that I had I want to make a good effort in the gym. So then I had my dinner which was a salad with some low fat Caesar dressing and I had some steamed vegetables of broccoli, courgettes and some mushrooms and then I had four of the heck sausages. So they're the chicken sausages, they're my favourite um, out of all the heck sausages and obviously they're low fat high protein so I had four of them. And then after dinner I had some Halo Top ice cream and some dark chocolate which is the 90% lint one. And then a bit later I had some low fat jelly with some of the low fat yoghurt on top, frozen fruit and some fruit and a few rice cakes. And I think I also had a couple of decaf teas or maybe one. Um, I'll show you guys on the screen. So that was it. And also, I am filming this on my camera. So I've got my camera back now. I'm back from Mauritius. I'm sorry that this video has taken so long to come out. Um, I've been really busy between my trips. And then also, I've just been to Barbados. So I got back from Barbados yesterday. Um, and I thought I'd film this, complete the video, and then I can put it up for you guys. So yeah, that's what I ate in a day on my day off. I am actually now going on a cut. And I've got a lot of short haul coming up. So... I was thinking of doing a day in the life of kind of cabin crew and showing you guys what I get up to on a day where I've got short haul and also what I eat and then kind of showing you what I take on the plane and stuff when I do like a there and back because short haul is just there and back in one day. So if you guys want to see that and you are interested then obviously pop a comment below and if you've got any feedback from this video comment below. I am still doing online coaching and personal training and I do macro profiling for people if you want your macros done and calories tailored to your goals or a program done for you. All of my information is in the description box below and my email and everything, my website uh, with all of my services. So you can, there's a form on my website if you want to, you can just fill that in and it goes straight to my email. I hope you guys liked that and also if you're not subscribed already, don't forget to subscribe and that really supports my channel, helps other people see it and obviously give the video a like if you did enjoy it and even if you didn't, you can give it a dislike, that's absolutely fine. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.